Oh, hello everybody, it's your boy Profshoff, and we're back again with a new set video. This is the Matchless Kung Fu Review Beggar Edition. Okay, let's go. I don't know what this is gonna be about, but it's a set video, so we're probably gonna enjoy it. Domain expansion, uh huh. Immaculate Crab Ooh, Rock. Damn. Domain expansion. Yo, he moving though. Hey, hey, disciples. Ooh. Seth here. Let me tell you about a game that's transformed. Hey, wait a second. Activated me. I have actually played this game. I actually played this. It's like a procedurally generated martial art Chinese thing. I'm gonna be honest with you, I did not enjoy it too much, but it was in early access, so maybe now it's better. The past many Let's days, check it out. The Matchless Kung Fu is matchless a immersive Kung sim Fu. that shows what life would be like if every man, woman, and child was trained in the martial arts. That is to say, uh, life would not last very long. This yeah. game takes place in the genre Yo. of Wuxia. This Wait. Are they troll? They're training the balls. Chinese sword fantasy fiction, Secret but a Kung Fu. More grounded than some Technique. I've covered in the past. The game mm -hmm. works like this. You play a world simulation where everyone has their own desires and motivation, yep. which you expand by putting down plots of land. Yeah, it's a These weird are system. Pre-made areas containing a challenge. If you finish mm. an objective, you can place more land and you keep going until inevitably a Shaolin master breaks your spine. Oh. You're not expected to win from the first or second oh. try. The actions you e took in a past life will Your homie said easy money. He <laughs> he, brother in Christ, what do you mean? Influence the next through karma, and you're not expected to understand any of this. That's why I don't mm. have to explain to you why I began my journey drop kicking roosters and Ooh. fighting with a family dog. Nor Damn. do I have to explain to you this the family dog, elaborate though? system of rock, paper, scissors that is Yo, combat. Why does the horse know kung fu as well? That is my question here. He throwing hands and legs, and, and I don't think it has because hands. The tutorial went over my What's head, it throwing? I retained the knowledge non verbally. And finally, despite being at the time of this review Damn. a complete demigod. God with perfectly harmonized Yo. meridians, I can confidently tell you I have no idea what's going on. It's a bug in my room. Product of RNG, my first Chinaman turned out looking okay. My very first quest was to beat the shit out of wine stealing monkeys. Only yeah. to find out animals can be tamed. I'm pretty sure I did the same quest, so I guess it's like a state like that's one quest that's not generated. Abilities it's for everybody. Between animals, but for the monkey, this was begging. The monkey oh. can beg for money, which infuriates the local beggar as I'm taking away from his local business. In this game, beggar is a profession, and just like dog yeah, in for some reason in Chinese, I've read some Chinese like webtoons, mangas. I don't know what they call them, and they usually have like these sects, right? There's usually a couple of main sects, and one of the sects usually is the beggar sect. So there's actually beggars that are kung fu masters, but they are still beggars after becoming kung fu masters. It's a weird thing. I I just check it up to culture differences. So I don't know. Doctors operate clinics. It's beggars weird. Operate churches. I was churches away and had to beg downhill instead. Then I got a quest to deal with some bandits. No problem. I thought until I saw they were too. Oh, by the way, the translation of this game last I played it is questionable. That's all I'm gonna say who could kill just by breathing on me. Luckily, my mm. objective wasn't to defeat them, just burn down their camp. This was very easy because they took several naps while I was doing Damn. so, only stopping when I burnt down their mattress. So they and you burned yourself down by the looks locals. Like. As it turns out, one of the bandits had the charitable perk, which ah. meant that she would rob the local store, beat up the owner, and donate all her savings directly to my monkey. I made a lot of money from the bandit the opposite of Robin Hood? and I found the constant brawls to be very entertaining. Until it wasn't, and the store owner was Actually, dead Robin. Floor. I realized Put. I had to do something, or I was going to lose a lot more NPCs. Mm. I lured the two bandits into a non-lethal sparring competition, Ooh. broke their strength, quickly rested, and jumped them again before they could recover. This bumped up my reputation, <laughs> and I was offered a selection of different schools oh. of martial arts. The B sect, the IC sect, the drunk sect, concealed weapon sect, misfortune sect, flame sect, poison gas sect, toxin sect, no, 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 no. Yeah. Naturally, I chose to join the, the drunk set. sect. Not only Ooh. did I get a bunch of skills that are simple enough that even I can reliably combo, I also got informed that I had a secret admirer. Oh. Who, may I ask? Well, the person telling me. And just like uh. that, I had a significant other. She sleeps Wait. on the floor. Wait, is this... It, it... <laughs> Is that still considered a secret admirer? Lore. Sorry, honey. She told the bed you. Is reserved for me. And the Where's the secret? As we lay together and pick lice out of each other's hair, our bond strengthens. Okay, that's bestiality, brother. Tropes, you can attend auctions to bid on rare and expensive items. Every time someone makes a bid for an item or increases, yeah, I never got bid, this far. Every guests become more jealous. Oh. If you let this play out in the background in its entirety, everyone who went to the auction is now seething with hatred and will try oh. to kill every other attendee. In this game, you don't get stronger from fighting. You get stronger by connecting. 
shapes the dog. in the right order to activate oh, inner yes. kung fu. In my case, however, uh, I got alcohol immunity. Yeah, this system was kind of confusing for me. You gotta, as you can see, like, the more you connect, the more, the bigger bonus it gets, and the higher level you are, the more connection points you get. It's I kind of interesting, the value but of this until yeah, that's I weird. I sat down for a drink and saw a small option to make a toast. I oh. could forcibly drink someone under the table, and when they're passed rob out, them. I could kidnap their body and God rob them blind, damn it. which is exactly what I did for the next hour, until everyone was running around in sub-zero temperatures in boxer shorts. <laughs> Putting down enough normal plots lets you place <laughs> special plots such as towns. Soon mm. as I entered, two men started bickering because one had slept with the other's wife. I intervened against infidelity, but a little too strongly, because he was now dead. I oh. sat down at the bar to continue my drunken robbery when the same woman who committed adultery try to seduce me honoring my beloved i reject which is on spree God her damn it. so she threatened to kill me if i said no and she did because she's got oh. 12k vigor so i reloaded and tried to beg for forgiveness instead she let me off lightly by breaking my legs the oh. irony of the situation is that she owned the town clinic and would help treat my crippling disability the next day i lived a good life i trained i mean to be honest that's a pretty good business model like, if people are not getting injured, they don't need a doctor. So why don't you injure them and then become the doctor? Maybe she was trying to injure his dick before this. And despite that, I am surrounded by sociopaths that could kill me on a whim. I hate this place. I'm going to go parkour across water. Going far north in the map is how you get Oh, by the way, in this game, the more you use a skill, the more XP you gain. It's kind of like Kenshi. It's a lot like Kenshi. But like Chinese version of Kenshi and imprisoned with magic this powers. Thing. This is how you unlock your second and third character what slots. As said before, you're not meant to win on the first try. Or rather, you're not the main character. The protagonist of this story is your ancestors. Oh. Quick briefing on power levels. Everything is about vigor, which is how much punishment you can take. No matter how good you are at finessing the combat and exploiting meridians, your starting character's vigor will cap off at around 2k. So for reference, which is at not your good. absolute peak. You are half as strong as a giant toad. How do hey, we that's remedy a big ass this? Toad. Genetics. Much like a trailer park is much more of a gene pond than a gene pool, your choice of partner has consequences on your child's oh. pedigree. You need to choose the right China Yo. man or China woman to chintigrate into your lineage. To if you're the offspring of a sect leader, you're born with 2k extra vigor. That's nice, Damn. but we need to go even harder. There are many myths, many legends. In high school, we used to nipple cripple each other. If you're not familiar, that's where you grab both nipples uh -huh. and twist painfully usually in the changing room when they're most vulnerable until one of our friends told us that's how a kid got nipple cancer because he nipple, got nipple cancer. crippled too often and it well technically if you don't have a nipple can you get nipple cancer just rip the nipple off at that point no became a tumor we knew the story was bullshit but we were scared and oh. we never did it again similarly i heard Smart. tales of people hitting 30k vigor and i think i know how some call it intuition i call it reading a guide on steam karma mm. are objectives you can put during enough. life that allow you to take different <laughs> blessings in the next our objective ah. pristine birthright requires the following 30 lovers 30 grudges or a million gold gold is out or. of question so i went with 30 grudges instead for reference the worst thing you can do to someone is destroying their kung fu understandably mm. beating someone so hard they forget how to move creates a lot of animosity. That's fucked At up. first, I was non-lethal and just battled people, stole their kung fu, and locked them in a cage. This got problematic very quickly. I would imprison someone's mother so their daughter would show up and start oh, breaking the cage from outside, trying to rescue them. <laughs> so I had to knock her out, put her in another cage, only to see the mother try to. Well, break. At least this way, you don't have to go out looking for the people. They come to you, or come in. You know, from inside to rescue her daughter. Everyone started bonding. Okay, that's kind of weird. Predicament, became friends and tried to make a prison break. Eventually, it was too much, so I had to start taking heads. All I wanted oh. was 30 enemies, but it seems now oh. I'm going to need 30 body bags. This was a problem because I couldn't keep track of the people I killed and their relations to one another. I accidentally killed off someone's parent, only to find out their daughter had 12k vigor and was chasing me across the land. I died several times Damn. and had to reload. The Big only way kid. I was going to survive was by friendship and paying the master of my I'm taking a couple a of heads not like that the shit out of her as i took her head i realized why do i even need this karma quest when i have a small army that can finish the entire game there are mm. no words to describe the experience of combat when your fights are stacked 20 against one except incredibly fair i thought i was invincible but i flew too close to the sun mm. you see slowly over time my army kept taking internal injuries but their oh. ai wouldn't let them go to a clinic for treatment and i didn't 
didn't pay attention. Suddenly, Shit. some of them died, which caused <gasps> their friends to blame me for their death, which forced me to fight them. But then, they died, and my other companions attacked me. My failure cascade was out of control, oh. and I died Everybody at my own men. I thought I was girl boss of this empire, but in truth, I was nothing but the boss baby. I looked back in the footage to figure out exactly where it all went. That, that is a that is a sentence one can say. He's just a boss and babe. Wrong, and surprisingly, it wasn't inflicted injuries. No, what happened was I ate shit to see what happens. And I saw the animation, and I thought it was really funny. However, my dysentery gave me a stack of poison gas, uh -huh. which spreads from close contact. My army was exclusively in close contact. First off, they were the shit army. Actually. Contact. So, the cause of death of everyone, and myself included, was my own excrement. But it turned out I made enough enemies in this life that I finished my karma quest. Pristine Birthright gives you the single biggest power spike in the game, if you can God actually damn. use it. If I could figure it out, I'm sure you can too. Yo, what in is you that? Use yourself, I actually use it. If I could you have to have all those connected, bro. That is crazy. Figure it out? I'm sure you can too. In case you do this yourself, I found out I didn't actually need grudges, and I could have just marked 30 people as enemies. Turns oh. out, force feeding people shit, gouging out their eyes, and repeatedly breaking their legs was completely unnecessary, and says a lot more about myself. My unscrupulous oh. actions would come to haunt me for my third character as I start with ill fate, which oh. means I'm more likely to be struck by lightning. I try to cheese the system by <laughs> praying for rain and speedrunning life. Unfortunately, lightning only oh. cooks you, so I tried dying to bandits. They refused to kill me as well. <laughs> Easy money. They put me in a cage and went to sleep. Occasionally, they would wake up and poison me before going back to sleep. This also <laughs> failed to kill me. Frustrated, I ran. Yeah, this sounds like a fun origin story. Into the Forbidden Palace. I which cannot is die. This game's version of the government. This off is myself. by people who are referred to as an incomplete person who are missing their precious treasure. This is a very Chinese what? way of saying they lost their penis. I could. Oh, no oh there are the Inuks. Yeah, Chinese have Inuks in government, or they had, I don't know, I how doubt they still have this, but listen, it's a lo it's 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 a big culture difference. Their lore is weird for me. Dynasties fossils so, would prevent yeah. nobles and public officials from seizing power because they couldn't produce children. But I digress. Anyway, I set fire to the palace, wow. and I was promptly executed. And it was all for nothing, Why throw because the my dog? negative karma was still there. Also, Ooh. I found out Groin Kick has a chance Wait, to so permanently... Wait, so... <laughs> First off, your kids, they get your karma from a previous life. That's fucked up. Crush your balls. That's fucked up. Do with this information as you will. So, I made my fourth and final character. Mm. Supreme Genetics. Excellent Ooh. karma. And you know what Wait, wait, wait. Let's, let's see the, bon the bonuses. Supreme Genetics. Noble sign, born into the ability you adhere of a renowned, a renowned martial arts lineage. When you reincarnate, you can choose the leader of a skilled family or prestigious sect as your parents. Genetics. Excellent. Free yourself from what desires, purge five banes and three demons. Okay. Karma. And you know what he does with it? Nothing. Huh? Because I unlocked Beast Tongue and can now tame infinite monkeys. Now, I have complete monopoly on the on entire monkeys. begging sector. Oh. This game is... Undeniably, what early the hell? Access. The translations can range from English to absolutely esoteric. The Emperor has ordered today the heroes are together to disrupt the rivers and the lakes. Biden is divided. The cracks are cracked. The cracks are cracked. The mages force their own selfishness, chaos, and even difficulties in life. They are even more lingering, lingering in the rivers and lakes, killing innocent and even chaotic order of. Okay, that is enough. That is enough. That is enough. But the gameplay is so intuitive, but I never felt like I was missing out. There is Brother, one exception to this. You're shit. It's what is this? Verbal duels. And they're completely insane. Yeah, I never did this. This is completely new to me. This is the equivalent of an online debate, where the objective is to mentally break your opponent. Instead of vigor, you use spirit. And Why does it look so goofy? And spirit will put them in hysteria. And hysteria can lead to death. Uh, this game lets you troll someone to death. It's damn. really hard to say. Why is he riding a chicken? In his sandbox a roast me. Roaster. The time I went to the riding cock? For a broken leg, only for the doctor to forcibly throw me outside because... It was one minute past his bedtime, oh my or God. was it my wife screaming at me for having an affair? As I have no option to explain to her that I have no relation to this giant black serpent, and it only holds... Set. 
It's feelings of intimacy for me because I implanted it with a love parasite. Since writing these lines, my world got flooded. What? I tried to swim north and got eaten by a great white shark. Oh. This came out of Yo, that is a so great the white. Me. This was the worst jump scare I've ever had. I got crinkles in my diapy and was very Jesus. afraid. So I'm giving this game a 0 out of 10. In oh. all seriousness, if you're willing to put up with a lot of bad translation and want a sandbox where you can live what is out that? the power a of killing everyone with your bare hands, then I thoroughly recommend it. For the price we're asking, I definitely got my money's worth. It's yeah. pleasant, it's charming, and there's a lot to explore, but I haven't had the time to cover. As always, more content to come, so stay Okay, well... Yeah, I mean... There's, uh, to be honest, lately uh, there's been a lot of Chinese RPG games that have been popping up. I've played a couple of them. Some are decent, to be completely honest. Some have good translations, some have absolutely awful translations. I'd put this in the decent tab. I played like a couple hours of this, enjoyed it. I don't usually play early access games, but yeah, it's fun. Anyway, let me know what y'all think. If you enjoyed this, if you've played this game, what you think about it. And I'll see y'all next time. Bye, everybody.